Oké, okay. luister goed. Nearly 300 years have passed since the creation of Saint Germain's World Trust. The time has now come to herald in a new age of peace and prosperity. We do not want an economic collapse, martial law, or new world order. We want Nassar now. The reversal, even light that will come to give energy to your vehicles, to your homes. No, I do not speak of solar. The incoming energy of the seventh ray of ceremony and order will be instrumental in bringing about these changes. Uh, didn't, didn't Michael Flynn, didn't Michael Flynn, didn't Michael Flynn recite Elizabeth Claire Prophet's prayer about the sevenfold rays and she's talking about the sevenfold rays and... Yes, he did, John, and it was at Hank Hunneman's church, which is also part of Kenneth Copeland's organization. We are your instrument of those sevenfold rays and all your archangels. All of them. And I am the instrument of those sevenfold rays and archangels. Didn't Flynn try to invocate the sevenfold rays? So isn't Flynn bringing in the new world order of love and light? Yeah. And education. The seventh ray has the ability to blend all of the rays into one great energetic light, bringing illumination, revelation, and order upon the earth. And a wonderful initiative towards this future is the United Nations International Year of Light and Light-Based Technologies in 2015. Throughout the year, the UN will seek to raise global awareness of the science and applications of light. Yeah, and the future of data, you know, being transmitted through Wi-Fi is the use of light, which is also known as Li-Fi. Look it up. <laughs> and of how optics and photonics can have a positive impact in fields as diverse as energy and education, agriculture and health. The UN Year of Light occurs at a time in human evolution when the heavens are opening, when the heavens are opening. When the heavens are opening. When the heavens are opening. And light is descending all around us, so beautifully symbolized by the all-seeing eye of space telescopes that catch the light radiating from the depths of the cosmos. The time has now come for this to be paralleled by inner vision. The Lucis Trust works to amplify the emerging light of human consciousness in the train towards inner unity and synthesis within humanity. We hope you will join us in this group service Alice and help Bay's to enter the vision Lucy's of humanity's next step forward is on its remarkable speaking. journey into an age of light. And see, as light, lightnings shall be the talk of your newspapers. And when you see this, rejoice, because light always overcomes the darkness, says the living God. Come on, lift up your hands and begin to shout unto God, man. Come on, come on, lift up your hands, lift up your voice. Let it be so, living God. Come on. The Lord just said something to me. He said one of the signs of what he speaks of and the way that this light will move is through sound frequency. Key frequency and light. Frequency and light. And God says 
that the sound of his voice, this that heaven speaks of at this time, light be. A being that stands somewhere around 6263, that weighs somewhere in the neighborhood of a couple of hundred pounds, a little better, has a span of eight and, I mean, at nine inches across, stood up and said, Light be! Light be! And this universe situated itself and went into motion. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Light be! Come on, give him one last shout of praise. Give him one last shout of praise. Come on, shout! Hank Koenemann. Jezus is Lucifer. Hun evangelie is het gnostische evangelie van Lucifer. En ze preken het en doen het allemaal in de naam van Jezus. En deze mensen die dat doen staan beschreven in Matthäus 7 vanaf vers 13 onder andere. Run from this Occult madness. Prettige dag.